Jack Clarks has scored the 2 0 up in eight minutes. That's up. 3 0. Yo, what's up guys, it is Ben and welcome back to another video. Today is Sheffield Wednesday versus Sunderland and I am back after a lengthy little two week break from the vlogs. I was getting nice and settled into uh, my new life at university so couldn't really attend some of the games and that might be a bit of a factor of some infrequency this season. Um, obviously I'm away from home and it's going to be a struggle to make quite a few matches so uh, don't expect a, a, a vlog every game just here and there and um, especially with our performances at the moment I mean I'm, I'm really not you know dying to miss out on a couple games here and there so yeah we'll see how it goes but yeah today uh, we've got a, a home game on a Friday night against a really really strong Sunderland side really that you know a, a side that could look like pushing for promotion this season so I'm not feeling too confident ahead of the game and um, you know obviously Sunderland uh, had a great season last season and they're following on from that and uh, yeah they were only in League One two seasons ago but um, us coming up from League One has been a, a, a real big struggle um, that Swansea game last week uh, even though I watched it on the telly it was still just painful to watch I mean I could have turned it off at any point but I just kept watching and it just got worse and worse and worse and worse and worse. I'm really not looking uh, too forward to this one due to the fact that I feel like it's not the fact whether we'll win or lose, it's the fact of um, how much we're going to lose by. And I'm going to say uh, a cheeky 3-0 Sunderland. I don't think we'll get a goal here. Obviously, Sunderland are a great side. I'll uh, be happy to get a goal really today. Uh, but yeah, we just we, it's a must win really. But I don't think we're going to win. Uh, we just need points at this point. We still haven't won a game this season. It's just depressing being a Wednesday fan. But still turning up, obviously. And um, still trying to enjoy games as much as I can. Uh, but yeah, we'll see how it goes today. Hopefully Wednesday can just put in a performance. I'm not even bothered if we don't win or, or lose. Because I'm confident that we won't win. I just want us to you know, put in a performance that that is better than the Swansea game because the Swansea game was absolutely horrendous. But yeah, let's move on to the lineups. Right then, guys, the lineups are as follows. In goal, we have got Devis Vasquez. Uh, we've got a back five. I think it's a back five. I'm not really sure because Zisco is just a bit of a clown and he switches the team all the time and, and the formation and he, we can't really find any system that works. I think it's Valentin as our uh, wing back with or with Patson. So Valentin and Patson wing backs, and then a back three of uh, Bernard, Bambo, Diaby, and Bamwo. Uh, and then I think it's a free midfield of Hendrick, uh, Byers, and Buckley, and then up top Gregory and Masaba. So yeah, I don't really know what to do. No banner, no Windass and Stein lineup. So uh, we'll have to see how it goes. It might be a, a, a quite quite a beating from from Sunderland to us today uh, but yeah let's move on to the bench on the bench we have got Dawson Palmer Iorfa Volks Backinson Delgado Gisama Fletcher and Smith so yeah I mean it's a decent bench there's a lot of options on there um, obviously no Volks no Bannon they must be injured and that is a big blow to our season I mean despite them not you know giving us uh, any wins this season they are still two of our best players probably so that's going to be a bit of a blow and um, what depends how long they're out for could really affect our season quite badly at this point but um, there was also talk of Kadamachi maybe coming in he was training with the first team this week but uh, he's obviously not in the first 18 uh, or not the first uh, first 11 or the bench so uh, we'll have to see in, uh, what happens with that uh, if he is training with the first team who knows maybe next week um, or next game he might he might come in and, and play I would like to give him a, a start to be honest because I mean with everyone we've got up top at the moment Fletcher uh, Smith Gregory they're just not offering much you know so I would not be opposed to trying someone new because at this point we try anything we can because we can't win any games but yeah uh, enough waffling, enough moaning about Wednesday. Let's just head off to the game and hopefully Wednesday can not get battered. Right then, come on the house.
17 is Paul Valentin. Number 17 is Sean Bernard. Number 21 is John Buckley. Number 22 is Jeff Hendry. Number 23 is Akin Fermeo. And number 45. Sheffield Wednesday doesn't play on the over over speakers. Don't know what's happening there, but let's get on with the game. Seen already. Four, three, four minutes in. Sunderland have already scored. In from the corner, and I don't even know what's happened. It's just in. It's just in. It's just that easy. Chance there is chance as well. Over here. Jack Clark's just scored the 2 0 up in eight minutes. 2 0 up in eight minutes. Suddenly going crazy again. I can't, I actually can't fucking believe this. I knew we'd lose, but fuck me, this is shot. This, this is bad. They've shot, they've had, they've scored every shot they've had. They've just come forward and scored. The defending is just. It's child-like defending. It's actually laughable. It's laughable defending. Fucking hell, this, this is going to be embarrassing. It's fucking embarrassing. So toxic here, yeah. so toxic. Just pass that out of play. Jesus, it's just so bad. I've had a few of this guard chance. It's really not, really not going well here. 14 minutes in. Sunderland are well on top, but just looking just disastrous. Super Sada! Oh. Oh. And we've just conceded a penalty. Uh, just at the 30th minute, penalty. About to be 3 0. Gee, this is shocking. Our, our fans are doing, our fans are also leaving. And we're only 30 minutes in. We've got we've got another hour of this shit. Oh my. It's shocking. It is just shocking. There goes the first half, booze all around, that is just, that was embarrassing. Yeah, I mean, Cisco's not got a clue. The team, the players, just don't give a fucking monkey. They're terrible. Playing, honestly shocking. It's some of the worst people I've ever seen when they play. Uh, in particular, I think Hendrik and Patterson have been absolute stinkers. I mean, Hendrik's just a ghost. Patterson's just bad, like, and the rest of them just aren't trying. The back line's terrible. I think Buckley's the only one that looks decent, and, and Masaba, but apart from those two, everyone's just terrible. I don't know what to say. 3 0 down. I don't want to watch the rest of the game. I want to go home already. Back out for the second half. The small murmurs and boos. Barely any clapping. Very toxic atmosphere. I mean, let's just see if the Al's can put in a. A better performance than the first, I and mean, it would be very hard. You could just probably stand around and perform better than he did in that first half. So, yeah, let's see how it goes. Cool, was it? Shoot, Masaba! Shoot! Oh. Oh. It's in there, shoot! Pato! Oh! Oh, we're not scored. Back in, Jeff, that's true. Oh, for fuck's sake. Oh my days. Jesus, this shit's end to end at the moment, but we should have just scored. They probably should have just scored. I don't know what's going on. Valentin is coming off for Delgado and 21. Uh, 21 Buckley off for the Sam. I don't think we should have taken Buckley off personally. I think Jeff Hendricks off, off, but oh well. Again, subs way too late. We're in like the 70th minute now. The game's completely gone, but okay. 
Gregory's coming off for Ashley Fletcher. Bambadil's coming off with a bit of a head injury there for Liam Palmer. So. Seven. Oh, I just want to go. Right then guys, back in from the game and uh, I mean, what do I really have to say about that one? Um, it was just terrible. It was just terrible. Am I surprised? No. I mean, I got the score prediction right at least. That's probably one bonus from this whole ordeal today going to this game. I got the score prediction right, 3-0 to uh, Sunderland. But yeah, I mean, the first half was just terrible. I mean, the game was over in seven minutes We can after we conceded the second goal. Uh, penalty conceded again, another penalty. Uh, once it was 3 now, I mean, it was definitely over. And then, you know, the second half, it was just boring. Like, there was just nothing to it. It was just boring. Like, literally, I felt like I was falling asleep with my eyes open, watching the game, and nothing was happening. I just, no substance, no passion, no desire. The players clearly don't care. I mean, we're 3 0 down. And the players are just playing like it's already over. They, they don't actually, uh, bo they're not bothered to get back in the game. And I mean, I, I'm not surprised, but yeah, that's just how it is at the moment. And uh, yeah, I'm just all for, you know, getting everyone out. Zisco first, he is just a shocking manager. He's got no tactics whatsoever. He puts out, I think he gets a hat with randomized names and randomized formations and just picks it out and then. He goes, there, yeah, we'll, we'll choose that team. And no tactics. Made subs in the 60th minute when we went 3-0 down in 30. He's just terrible. Chan Siri as well, he's got to go. Especially after the statement he released today. I mean, yeah, the club is just in a right state right now. We need a whole rebound from, from the top down, really. Just to get a new club. Because uh, this, this club we've got right now is rotten. Sheffield Wednesday is rotten. I mean, the players today, I really wasn't impressed. They just don't care anymore, and I think that's kind of blindly obvious. Uh, but yeah, I guess that's it for me. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed. Please make sure to leave a like down below, subscribe if you're new to my channel. Also, hit the bell icon to get notified every time I upload the last minute for me. Hope you've enjoyed. I'll see you in the next one. Peace.